Check one, two, go. Yeah, we're cool. My name is Gary Richards. I was originally born in Washington, D.C. I produced the Hard Festival and I DJ under the name of Destructo. When I was a kid, my dad used to take me to a lot of concerts. He was really instrumental in working with groups like Kraftwerk and a lot of hip hop groups. So I always heard the computer sounds, the drum machines. And like maybe early 1989, I went to a warehouse in downtown LA and heard like electronic music. I was like, this is it, like this is what I love, you know? Every music has a history. I value that I know the history of like rock and roll through my dad, the history of hip hop, disco, funk, like I know all these different styles of music. And my music, electronic, people should know that history too. People today, they think it just started with like, you know, Wolfgang Gartner was like the first like electronic DJ. You know what I mean? He, he's great, but like, there's 20 years of dudes before him, and kids don't know that. That's why, you know, we brought Underworld, I'm trying to bring Chemical Brothers, all those groups, they created this. It's important for people to know that, for electronic music to continue building its history. When I first started, well, let's say I wasn't the most technically savvy DJ, so it was a little destructive, maybe the way I was mixing the beats, plus I always liked metal. I was trying to mix like a Metallica record with techno record and you know, it's hard to do that. Sometimes I'd maybe play it too loud and blow something up. I got hired to work at a record label and the guys that I worked with, like we always thought like, like rock and electronic were going to kind of like come together. You know, that, that was our thing on it, you know, and obviously it spun off into like a million different things. I'm a lot more chill now, you know, I, now I'm like just a smooth DJ, like that's what I like to do. But I think in the beginning I was just, just a wild kid, you know. I get up really early and uh, go right to my computer, I start talking to people in Europe, people around the globe, emailing, returning emails, and then, um, you know, then my kids wake up, and then they go off to school with their mom, and then I work all day, drive home, and then back to the computer, listening to music and doing, you know, email, and that's, that's pretty much every day. <laughs> Right now, we're working on Hard Summer. It's the biggest festival in Los Angeles now, and we're going two days, and we're just trying to get everything right with the city. Department of Transportation, Bureau of Street Services, parking, the Metro, PD, fire, sheriff, you know, it's a big event. And based on events that have happened in the city of LA in the past, there's a lot of oversight, a lot of restrictions, and everyone's watching what we're doing. So I feel we're up for the task. We have a good team and we know how to execute these events. It's just, it gets overshadowed because it's electronic music. <laughs> On New Year's Eve this year, it'll be our five year anniversary. So our first event, it was New Year's Eve 2007. We had Justice and Peaches and Two Live Crew, A-Track, Aoki, Busy P. It was, it was awesome, you know, that was our first event for once in my career, hooked up with the right artists right at the right time. You know, I was always working with these artists like way before they had their kind of like explosion. There's a lot of great artists that never get big. They're still great. You know, they just weren't popular. We got hard summer coming up. We've got a little surprise for the Haunted Mansion. Uh, we're gonna twist things up this year, do something a little different. And then uh, we're planning for Holy Ship for 2013. Holy Ship is basically we take our idea of having all different styles of the best electronic music and put it on a cruise ship with 3,000 people. We went from Fort Lauderdale to the Bahamas in a private island and then back. And uh, it was the time of everyone's life. And the boat's like amazing because it has five venues on the boat. There's like a theater, a disco, a couple bars, the top deck. It's pretty amazing. Hopefully we'll see you this summer at Hard, August 3 and 4. If you want more details, check hardfest.com.